So I haven't really vlogged that much today at all, uh, other than the little bit this morning. Um, but I'm just getting ready, or we, I'm getting ready to go out for some dinner. Ian's just woken up from a nap. Um, so I'm sort of dressed. I just need to, I'm going to put a pink dress on. Um, and I've curled my hair today, even though it's falling out everywhere. It's driving me mad. Um, but we went to the um, barbecue van. Oh my goodness, the food was so nice. Um, for some reason, the footage and the pictures I've taken on my phone um, have saved in a different setting and I can't actually get them to work with the um, editing software that I'm using. So I've changed the setting that they're being saved in and hopefully from now on I will be able to add pictures and things to um, the vlog. So. There should have been more bits added to the vlog that I'm actually rendering at the moment, uh, but I just couldn't get the um, the pictures on there because they, the format was, or the, the way they were saved was completely wrong. Um, so hopefully from now on, <laughs> fingers crossed, that I'll be able to um, upload pictures, but I will be putting all my pictures on Facebook and I will also be adding stuff to my Insta stories and putting pictures on Instagram and things like that. So yeah, if you want to go and follow one of them, they are all linked down below. Uh, tonight, I don't really know what we're having for dinner. Maybe going to Victoria, um, which is a restaurant in uh, Bejeeba. Not 100%. We might change our mind. I don't know. Um, but after we went to... Um, no, before we went to the barbecue van, we actually went to Pavi and got a load of shopping, um, drinks and toilet roll <laughs> um, and a few snacks and things like that. Um, and then we came back and then we sat around the pool for a little while and that was really nice. It was really, really hot. But then the clouds sort of came over. It was like misty clouds. Um, and it did cool down quite a bit and it was it was quite nice um, and then I think we came back down here about half four five might have been about five o'clock um, and I've just been editing had a shower I didn't actually wash my hair I just rinsed it through um, so that's why I've curled it um, so yeah and like I've said last year I'm here for three weeks so the first couple of vlogs um, there might not actually be anything interesting other than me talking <laughs> I don't know uh, but we're here for three weeks so there will be quite a lot to film and this drawer is driving me mad this drawer here with my clothes in it will not stay shut it will just open again all by itself but yeah so I'm just editing um, or just rendering the first Malta vlog and I've also had to put the laptop here to plug it in because where I was sitting in the kitchen up the table there is actually no plugs that I can plug in. I did bring um, an extension lead uh, but the only plug in the kitchen is where the kettle is plugged in and you can either have the kettle or the toaster. Um, so I thought I'd put it here instead. Um, anyway we're going to get ready and go for some something to eat. Um, and see what we actually go for. <laughs> Good morning, it is Saturday, I nearly said Friday. I didn't vlog anything yesterday, um, but today is Saturday and we are going to Slima and I'm gonna try and get um, a pair of Birkenstocks, the, like the rubber type ones, um, plastic, whatever you wanna call it. And then I want to, then we're gonna go to Popeye jetty and hopefully there'll be room for us to park so we can go swimming um, as we've not swam in the sea um, this year yet but hopefully we can do that today and uh, yeah so I woke up this morning with a banging headache I've taken tablets and I've taken another lot of tablets as it is now half past 11 yeah, 20 to 12 um, so we're gonna make a move in a moment and it looks lovely and sunny out there as usual um, and if anyone is wondering, because I did put a picture up in our group chat, um, but if anyone is wondering, my face here, um, 
a lot of you probably will know from last year but I have vitiligo so vitiligo is a loss of pigment in your skin I've got it on my hands and I've got it on my face as well so some parts of my face where this is worse than last year I had it just in the corners last year now I've got it underneath my uh, bottom lip and around my eye um, they they say that it can get worse um, and mine has like around my lips but I've got it on my hands I've also got a bit on my arm and on that hand as well um, it doesn't personally bother me um, my face is a bit mm, I wish it wasn't on my lip but I can't do anything about it really uh, my hands don't bother me at all like it's not a disease or anything <laughs> uh, so yeah that's well yeah but it's not like a nasty dirty disease when they told me years ago that I had fungal infection and um, they gave me like a fungal cream and whatever because it was on my hands and she gave me a fungal cream and that did not do anything until the doc one of the doctors actually sent me to a dermatologist and they said it is definitely vitiligo so yeah anyway not, uh, a, fungal not a fungal infection no which when she said that I was just like oh that sounds disgusting <laughs> but yes anyway that's enough about that we're gonna make a move and try and get myself some shoes and uh, hopefully go swimming. We're now in Popeye, well not in Popeye village but we are swimming at the jetty. Um, <laughs> I don't know how much you'll be able to see because of the sun or, no or even hear me.
So we've been swimming um, at Popeye, so I did um, use the GoPro, so hopefully that might work, or hopefully it will work. Uh, but we've just come up to a church that is literally on the end of the cliff. So that is the edge there. Um, and then you've got down there as well. Um, so we've just come up here, we've got an ice cream. So if I've got any around my face, then that's why. But um, it's lovely and sunny still. The sun is so hot. Um, my legs were, they're not so bad now, but I thought I was getting prickly heat. Uh, but it is just so lovely here. And there's a statue up here. And I'm really dark, so I'll come back when I get there. <laughs> So as you can see, it's just nothing. As you can see right here, it just drops into the sea, but it is beautiful out there today. The water was cold, but not too cold. Sorry if you can hear the wind, I don't have a wind muff for my camera, but it's lovely. guys today is Sunday and we have come to this building here <laughs> um, it's like a radio transmission place I don't know but it's completely derelict now um, I think they still use the building um, the thing at the top isn't spinning but last year it did Ian's gone up with his drone don't know whether you can see that I can't even see the screen um, but today's Sunday and Literally nothing is open on Sundays and also all the Maltese people go to the beach so it's like a complete nightmare to do anything. So Ian thought he would come and fly his drone for a little while, um, which is all good with me obviously. Um, I'm just like sunning it up, <laughs> walking around. Um, so yeah, but it is so hot today. Uh, but I thought I'd quickly show you around here. Um, some of the things that I show you will be repeats from last year but you never know some of the buildings might look different because they've um, deteriorated more or been knocked down and things like that so yeah I thought I would just show you around um, so yeah Ian is currently behind this wall because there's a little bit of shade but there's the building it's got lights and everything um, so Wonderful view from here. These buildings don't look like they've actually changed at all. <laughs> um, the roof was on that one was already collapsed last year. There's probably more graffiti and things inside. Um, but I haven't been inside any of them. People have barbecues. I think the stairs in this one are missing as well. Yes. <laughs> Don't know if you can see. But this is the view from the other side. So just some random walls and 
another thing here that, which I'm assuming had some sort of tank inside the way that them walls are so this is the first time Ian's gone up with a drone um, this this year here so um, I don't know whether he will record anything or whether he's just getting used to it and whatever so I don't know whether there will be any footage to add to this vlog um, but I do know that Ian will be um, putting some footage up on his own channel which is Ian Miles and I will link it down below in the description box but it's just really nice here it's so hot really hot I put I have put sunscreen on so don't worry um, I had to buy some more because the stuff that we bought with us was like clay it was horrible um, so we're just gonna chill here for a little bit and maybe go somewhere else for Ian to drone I'm not 100% sure yet uh, but I'm sure that we will catch you up when we get to wherever we're gonna go so we're now back at the room and it is I don't even know what the time is probably about nine half nine um, we drove around for so long trying to find somewhere to park and eat <laughs> but everywhere is just so busy and if we want to park somewhere and go for something to eat you've got to walk like a mile and no so yeah we finally got parked uh we went into bad ball and i didn't vlog the food um and i didn't even take a picture of the food <laughs> um but i had a mushroom bruschetta to start and a spaghetti bolognese ian had calamari and a meat platter thing i say it was a meat platter it was um three different types of meat sliced on a plate with some chips and salad um and that's that um so i'll probably leave this vlog here i don't want to make them too long and also i've got the footage that you would have seen already of the gopro and things so i don't think ian done any recording on his drone today so i won't have any of that to add but hopefully at some point that i will uh so i'm gonna go and cool down because it's so hot in this room <laughs> i've put the aircon on and hopefully it will cool down very soon so thank you for watching please uh, subscribe if you want to watch more of my holiday and I shall see you all in the next one bye